Hi everybody, welcome to the channel. Today we're going to do a very quick video on the new leaked images of the Lowe's animatronics for 2024. Now I apologize, this won't have my usual editing and my quick wit and fun because it's super late and I have to go to work tomorrow. But at least I still have my good looks. What? Oh. <laughs> Before I get into it, I want to thank Halloween Decorating Fanatics for posting all these images. They're awesome. Thank you for bringing this info to all of us haunters out there. We appreciate it. Follow them on Facebook and on YouTube. Let's get started. To begin with, Lowe's has a couple themes this year, and one of them is the Wednesday TV show. Now I haven't watched the show myself. I love The Addams Family, the original. I haven't watched Wednesday, so I apologize that I'm not as familiar with a couple of these things. First of all, we have Wednesday Adams. Now, this prop does a dance from the TV show. I think it looks kind of like this. It looks cool. It's a cool looking prop. I don't know how good the dance is or if she's just gonna kind of turn like this. We'll have to wait and see. Not a prop for me because I haven't watched the show, but if you like the show, then this is the must-have prop of the season. So next we have Cousin It. Big mop of hair, sunglasses, and a hat. It looks great. It looks like it's a, a roaming prop. Again, if you like the show, this prop's for you. I like the original Adams Family, but without the other main cast members, I probably wouldn't get Cousin It either. But it's very cool. If you like the show, go and get it. Another character from the show, Joseph Crackstone, or as I like to call it, but ugly guy with a green glowing stick. Apparently he's the antagonist from the show, and they've got a really expensive seven and a half foot prop for him. Probably cool, he's got the fog that comes out of the mouth, he, he speaks, he's got the glowy stick thing, his eyes glow. If he's as ugly looking as the show, it's gonna be a scary prop, so keep him away from kids. And if you're gonna get those, you might as well get the Nevermore Academy archway. I don't know the show, I think this is the school she goes to, but it's it's a cool looking archway. Not a whole lot else to say about it. Now, moving on from Wednesday Adams, we've got our giant, I believe 12 foot, bone collector. Now this is one big ugly dude. He talks, his head moves, he's got a big ass shovel and a bag of bones and not really my thing. If you're going for a whole scene of grave robbers and grave diggers and have a whole family of weirdos just out there working the graveyard. Now we're going to transition into Lowe's other theme, which is the nautical theme. Not something I was expecting. Now we're going to start off with the seaweed witch, and this is probably one of my least favorite of the group. She's just not very interesting looking. I guess the hand with the staff moves, her mouth moves, maybe she has cool phrases, but she's Kind of generic. Not as nice looking as another witch that we're going to talk about. I don't know if we have a price on this one, so maybe she's a, a cheaper one, but we have to see her in person, see her in action. So now on to the witch that I like, the Servo Sea Witch. And this is a cool looking prop. Uh, she looks very realistic. She's got the servo movement. I think the eyes don't move. She's not like Lethal Lily that way. I believe the eyes light up. She's got the servo mouth and head movement. The arm lifts up to reveal a claw. It's a cool looking prop. I'm really interested in this one. Probably one of my favorites out of this lineup. Can't wait to see her in action. So next we have a prop that's not an animatronic. It's a static prop. It's a three and a half foot Kraken head. It's a cool looking prop. Because my family wants to do a pirate theme, this could be something we pick up. It's got LED lights on the tentacles and it's just cool looking. It's neat. You create a water scene, you have them coming out. It's $200 so that's a Pretty reasonable price, have to see it in person, but I could see us possibly picking this up. Next we have a prop that seems like it's one of the favorites for everyone, it's the Haunted Deep Sea Diver. This is a cool looking prop, it's one of those old fashioned diving suits, the light lights up and you can see the skull inside, it's got like side to side movement I think. It's a cool looking prop. Now the price they have estimated is $350. So that could be a lot for this, but if the price is less than that, or if it's even cooler than we think, then it's a possibility. I really do like the look of this prop, and again, it, it's cool fitting in with that nautical theme. And finally, one more prop for the nautical theme, we have the Ghost Captain. Again, it's a cool looking prop, it's got the head movement, the mouth moves, the glowing eyes, and the steering wheel moves, so it looks like he's steering. He's got the blue light that shines on him to give him that kind of eerie ghostly glow. 
Very cool prop. You'd have to create like a ship scene for him because he's got the steering wheel and if it's just steering in your yard it might look kind of funny but if you can create the right scene for him it's a very cool prop. I do like this one. I'm curious to see how it sounds and what he says. Again, $350. It's a little much. I think if it was less, I would really consider getting this because I think it's a cool prop. Reclothe it to make it pirate themed pretty easily. So another one I've got my eyes on for Lowe's, but we'll see. And last but certainly not least, we've got three new band members. Last year, Lowe's released a guitarist and a drummer and they would play Bluetooth so you could put your music on and they would play to the beat of the music. Well, now they've got the singer who looks cool. He's got his foot up on a uh, like a gravestone. You've got another guitarist with a cool looking green guitar and his eyes glow red. And last, we've got the keyboardist, which has a cool like shaved head with like the rest of the hair flopping over and very cool looking. How these all work together, we'll have to wait and see. But if you have the band members from last year, I mean, this is a cool addition. You can have this whole band playing. Now the singer, I'm curious to see how that works because if he's just moving to the beat, it's not going to look great. I don't know how they would make him sing to the song. So if they could pull that off, that would be awesome. But they're very cool looking and it's a great addition. If you have the other members, you got a big band coming. So there we go. So what do I think of Lowe's lineup this year? Well, if you're a fan of Wednesday Adams, that show, then yeah, that they got some cool stuff for you there. If you like the nautical theme, then they've got really cool stuff and I really like the props that they have. That said, it's a little niche. I don't know how many people are going to use those for their haunts. Now you could take the witches, you could probably use the witches separately because they just look like cool witches. So you could probably get away with using them. I don't know what their words are, but the Kraken, the Sea Captain, the Diver. Unless you're doing some kind of nautical theme, I don't know how you would fit it in. but. They're very cool. The Bone Collector, I mean, if you have a big graveyard scene and you're just collecting big 12 foot guys, then yeah, it's not a prop that's clearly made for me. So if you like it, go get it. And then the band, you can't go wrong with that band. It was cool last year. These new additions are going to make it that much better. So I can't wait to see people to have all five set up playing. I didn't get them last year, but I think they're very cool. And if you had them all going, gonna look awesome. Grading these without seeing the animations and everything, I mean I would give probably give it like a B minus. I think the props that they have look cool if you're interested in them. If you're just someone with a pretty basic Halloween stuff then it's not really a lot for you in this. If you like the theming it's awesome. If you like what you saw please hit the like button if you're new subscribe and no matter who you are thank you for watching. Don't forget, I am Scare Dad. Spooky season's coming, so go get ready. It's Wednesday, Wednesday. Gotta go by that Wednesday. Excuse me? What? Who doesn't like my singing? You?